With Memorial Day just around the corner, many events are planned to commemorate those who've sacrificed their lives for our country. 2822 Sydney Costas visited Wayne County this morning and learned how the county is permanently honoring women in the military. A new monument stands big and tall at the corner of 9th and Court Street in Honesdale Thursday morning. Block letters stating salute to military women catch the eyes of many in the community. Well, it's about time they honored the women, you know. I mean, they honored us, you know. But hey, the women were there too fighting the wars. Veterans like Carl McGusson and Robert Hickey say they're glad to see the recognition for service women. Getting to see this is just amazing because this is a community that is really what America is about. The massive monument displays women soldiers in battle along with information about their roles in service. The woman behind the project is Kim Erickson. She says it's been two years in the making. Somebody approached me and said, did you ever realize that there's usually only men on military monuments? And I never took notice. So then I said, I can fix that problem. Installing the monument and laying down sidewalk has been underway for about a month. Now complete, it will be officially unveiled this weekend, where women veterans like Margaret Allen's mother will be recognized. She was in the Marines during the Korean War, and um, she was a mechanical draftsman. The unveiling will be part of a dedication ceremony beginning at 11 a.m. on Saturday. To think that we were out here just for a few minutes and people already noticed that we have a new addition to town. They wanted to come and celebrate with us. That was a really beautiful thing. You just need that one person that it affects and you're like, I did a good thing. In Honesdale, Sydney Costas, 2822 News. Erickson says the monument was funded by donations from the community. Job well done.